Welcome back. The Polk County Fair is underway in fertile Minnesota. This year marks the 116th annual fair, making it one of the most successful in our region. The fair, of course, is full of tradition. The Concordia Food Stand has been in business for 92 years. It raises money for the local Lutheran Church and its missions. The success of all the rest on the backs of the 150 volunteers or so who make the Concordia Food Stand's home-cooked meals a fair favorite. Some folks have been volunteering here for 60 years. I was going to say I was on the board, the third board, for 40 years. Okay. In 1954, but I, about 10 years ago, I retired from the tour board. Okay. And now they got me peeling potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> Admission to the Polk County Fair is free. It runs through Sunday. We have a link of the full list of events. Just go to our website at valleynewslive.com and click on this story. Letting your unique style shine is something one local artist is trying to teach people with her new business. Carrie's Twisted Art near Main Avenue in Fargo offers classes and they'll even come to you for an event. On the Valley Today this morning, reporter Ashley Bishop and Carrie Schwanke made a rose out of egg cartons and used recycled materials. Carrie's Twisted Art has public events three times a week with prices starting at $30. To learn more about upcoming classes, click on this story at valleynewslive.com. Hungry? <laughs> Not for that one. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I was watching. Oh, you were? Oh, well, attention. then forget about it. Let's, what's coming up in sports? Uh, the Twins. They had a long <laughs> night last night, and then they turn around and play a day game today. We've got highlights for you next in sports. <laughs>